What's Halloween, Mobos? Welcome back to The Mesa Live. Today is Monday, October 30th. I'm Sean, and this is my co-anchor, Jackson. Please stand and join us for the Pledge of Allegiance. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Hey Lobos, our Halloween bash is coming up. Tomorrow from 3.30 until 5 p.m., you'll be having an amazing DJ, party pumper, and food and drinks will be included in the ticket price. Tickets are still only $10, but the price will be $15 at the door. Get yours sooner rather than later. Don't forget to come out and be a part of La Mesa's annual costume contest. The, ab the event will be held on the quad tomorrow at lunch and, and we will be judging the scariest, the funniest, and the most original costumes. See you there, Lobos. Attention Circle Friends members, please meet today in the NPR at lunch. Hi Lobos, are you ready to have an awesome day while dressing up as your favorite meme? Well on Wednesday, November 15th, ASB is having a meme day where you dress up as your favorite meme and have fun doing it. At lunch, we will have a competition and we will be crowning meme queen and king. Remember to be appropriate or we will have to disqualify you from the competition. One person from each team must participate to earn team points. To win, you must be the best dressed meme. Remember to have fun. Hey Lobos, our volleyball tournament has officially kicked off. The Six Diamond Penguins, Bottle Caps, Twin Towers and Company, and Court Crushers will be playing in the gym on Thursday, November 2nd. All teams, all teams meet in the gym within five minutes of the lunch bell. See you guys there. One of the new teams on campus is the Matadors. It's a seventh grade team made up of some new teachers and some seasoned teachers. Take a look. I recently got a new seventh grade team called the Matadors. And we at La Mesa Live would like to shine a little light on the subject of who are the Matadors? First on the Matadors, we have World History with Mr. Peterson. Hi, my name is Mr. Peterson. And one thing you need to know about me is I love everything about history. Things that I like about Mr. Peterson is that he's fun, he's really high spirit, he likes really like a lot of things that I like, he's relatable. <laughs> Next on the list, we have Mr. McCarthy. My name is John McCarthy. I have the kids calling me Mr. McCarthy. I love middle school students and I love teaching science. Mr. McCarthy is a very uh, funny teacher. He's a good science teacher. He's teaching. And now in English, Mrs. Rose. Hi, my name is Mrs. Rose. I'm happy to be here at La Mesa this year. One thing I'd like for you all to know about me is one of my daughters is a sixth grader, about to become a seventh grader, so all of my seventh graders, I'm looking to you to help me to become a junior high parent. So uh, it's, it's fun watching all of you, and I'm excited for the year. What I like about Miss Rose is that she teaches a lot about English, and I really like her because she's really helpful when she teaches us English. And next we have Miss Daisha. Hi, I'm Mrs. Daisha and I'm a seventh grade math teacher for the Matadors. Go Matadors! And one thing that you should know about me is I like to win, and Matadors are going to win this year at everything. I like Miss Stacia because she's really nice, and when I need help with my homework or with my classwork, she's always there for me and helps me out with what I need. And last, but certainly not least, English with Mrs. Hartman. Hi, I'm Mrs. Hartman, the English teacher on the Matador team. 
Um, and probably the thing that you should know about me, which is kind of a newer thing, is that I'm going to be a mom soon. We're expecting our baby boy in February. What I like about Miss Hartman is every morning when we walk in, she always has a smile on her face and she loves to see us smiling. And if we need any help on our homework or anything, she's always like there to help us out. And if anything's going on in our life, she'll always be there with us. And she's just so funny and so like happy. I'm glad she's my teacher. We hope you know a little more about the Matadors. And thank you to the teachers for letting us film them in their classes. Today in history, on October 30th, 1938, a nationwide panic was caused by the radio broadcast of Orson Welles' War of the Worlds. The radio play was extremely realistic, and many listeners actually believed that the world was under attack by Martians. Today is also the birthday of the second president of the United States, John Adams. He would have been 282 years old. The word of the day for today is affidavit. It is a noun. The definition is an official written and sworn statement. A sample sentence would be, Mo tried to make Brian sign an affidavit that she would divulge her secret to no one. Something you should know about today. Today is National Candy Corn Day. Candy Corn was created by George Renninger of Wonderly Candy Company in the late 1800s. He created the sweet treat to represent the bright colors of corn kernels. Originally, candy corn was yellow, orange, and white, but it, was, but it has become popular in other colors as well. This confection was originally made by hand using corn syrup, sugar, water, marshmallows, fondant, and carnauba wax, a wax made from the leaves of palm trees, but is now produced using machines. The original ingredients are still used in the recipe. Well, that's our show. Thanks for watching. Join us tomorrow for our special Halloween episode. For Jackson and the entire crew of La Mesa Live, I'm Sean. Have a magnificent Monday.